Hey you guys, how are we all? Welcome back to another one of my videos. If you're new here, my name is Holly and thank you so, so much for watching. A little bit of a disclaimer for this one. I'm sure you know what this video is by the title, but I'm gonna ramble just quickly before I get started because I have a few things I wanna say. First and foremost, Happy New Year's, guys. I really hope that you all had a really good 2021 and here's to 2022. I know that I personally am hoping 2022 is a bit better than 2021 because 2021 kind of sucked for me I'm not gonna lie but there was some good things that happened too so I guess you, you get the good with the bad don't you and lastly I just wanted to say a massive massive thank you to all of you that have subscribed I just feel so lucky to have gained so many new subscribers especially recently I've really really gained quite a few and I'm so close to hitting a thousand I'm so excited please feel free to tell your friends and family about my little channel tell them to subscribe because I'm hoping I get to a thousand by the end of January we'll see oh and also last thing I'm actually gonna put out two videos this week this one and then I'm gonna have another vlog of my New Year's up on Sunday I figured I'd do two videos this week because I'm not doing a true crime video I don't know if I've spoken about this before but my true crime videos take so long to research and so as much as I absolutely love doing them they're my favorite videos to make and it seems like they're your guys' favorite to watch too. I just haven't really had time to do one this week. I'm in the process of moving in like a week and a bit. I think I'm gonna end up moving and I still don't know where I'm moving so there's just a lot going on. So that's kind of why I haven't done one this week but next Sunday I will definitely have one up for you guys. I promise. But without further ado let's get into this video. So what I got for Christmas 2021 I feel like every birthday and Christmas I always get very spoiled so I'm very very grateful and and thank you to all of you that got me a Christmas present. If any of you are watching, thank you so, so much. I love all of them. I guess to start, I'll show you what I got from my mum or my mum and my dad. I always just say my mum. Do any of you guys do that? Because you, you kind of know that like mum's the one that like got all the presents. I got this Caseify case. I still have an iPhone 10 and just try to keep it for as long as I can only because phones are so expensive and I just haven't wanted to upgrade. I don't really care about having the newest phone. I definitely did in high school, but I feel like now I couldn't care less. But I am getting to the point where I do kind of want a new one. So I figured if I get like a really nice case, then I'll sort of re-love my phone. I think I'll get a new one for my birthday in October. But anyways, I got this really cool Caseify case and I really appreciate it from my parents. Thank you. The next thing that my parents got, I actually don't have here because it's currently getting tailored. It's this really pretty little linen pink dress from seed I'm getting it tailored because it was quite long and I don't really wear long dresses so I've actually turned it into like a above the knee dress but I knew that I would wear it more if I got it tailored to that length my beautiful cousin actually who has her own website she makes clothes and so I asked her to tailor it for me so that is currently what is happening with that dress and I'll link my cousin's website below too by the way guys my parents also actually got me this book and I think my dad did definitely know about this one I think he actually chose this one but as you can see it's called the barefoot investor I've actually wanted this book for a while so I really appreciate it me and my partner Liam are hoping to buy an apartment in early 2023 I forgot what year it was for a second but in early 2023 we're hoping to buy an apartment and we can use the saving tips that's for sure especially if this book has any tips on how to buy less takeaway food I'll be taking those on board because takeaway food is my downfall and going out to eat at cafes oh my gosh if you guys knew how much money I spend each week on cafes and takeaway food like I don't even know because I'm too scared to look at my bank account but I will definitely start reading this soon after I go to the cafe maybe a few more times the next present that I got was from my I'll just call her my sister-in-law her name is Holly also and she got me a set of Peter Alexander pajamas that look like this they are so comfy and the pants are just matching long pants I'll do a little try on clip after all of this so you guys can see what they look like on um, but I'm really really happy about this because I actually don't have any 
winter pajamas at the moment. Liam's parents then got me this beautiful crystal. I never know how to pronounce this one. I think it's pyrite or pyrite. I love crystals. Would you guys be interested in a crystal haul if I did one? I don't know if any of you would be interested in that, but let me know down below if any of you would watch. And also she got me this little stand to go with it or they, Liam's mum and dad, so that I can display it like that. Oh my gosh, so cute. And then they also got me this dressing gown, which is so soft. I've never had a fancy dressing gown ever. I literally always buy my dressing gowns from Kmart and there's nothing wrong with Kmart. There's nothing wrong with Kmart, but it's kind of nice to have like a nice fancy feeling dressing gown. I will definitely use this in winter because I'm just eternally cold in winter. Like literally, I do not feel warm for the whole of winter. Next, my nan and pa got me a little, what is this? A Christmas decoration. Actually, they got me two Christmas decorations. They got me this little angel one, and then they got me this one. I think it's like Jesus in the manger. I will definitely be using them on my tree next year, so thank you, Nan and Pa. They also got me a little voucher for Sephora, and I'm very excited to use this. I already know what I'm gonna get, which is a new Estee Lauder foundation, because they literally have the best foundation ever. And I'm also gonna get a new eyebrow pencil. I can't remember what the brand is, but I'll put a photo of it up on here too, and this is also my favorite eyebrow pencil. Oh, I got more stuff from Mum and Dad, which I forgot to show you so I'll show it now. They also got me this set of three little, I think they're bamboo containers. There's just three different sizes with different prints on. That's the third one. They're just super cute. I love little Tupperware containers. I always lose mine. Actually, it's not normally me that loses them. It's somebody else that I live with who forgets to bring them home from work. 10 points to whoever can guess who I'm talking about. Mum and Dad also got me this massive scrunchie which I appreciate. It's kind of a really random present now that I think about it but I've already used it and I really really like it so thank you mum. And then of course what is a Christmas if you don't get a brand new pack of undies? Mum actually said she got these for me because they match my phone case that she got me but now that I think about it they don't really match at all so I don't know what she was talking about. Maybe she meant the color at the top. I don't know. Then one of my friends M got me this Palo Santo. It's basically just wood sticks that you use to like cleanse your crystals and cleanse your house and I actually might do it today because I've been having really bad dreams recently. And she also got me this obsidian point. It's like a bit speckled. I don't know if it's meant to be to be honest. I don't know if you'll be able to tell in the camera either but I really really like it. This piece of stuff is on the top so it didn't get damaged on the way here I'm guessing by the way. M also got me this bag of stuff from Frank Body. So the first thing she got me is a marshmallow body scrub and the second thing she got me is this coffee scrub. Original coffee scrub. I love the coffee scrubs from Frank Body. I don't know if you remember this M but you actually got me a body scrub for my birthday and I've almost used all of it so this was really good timing. Thank you. And then my good friend Naomi got me this face mask from Patchology. I've never actually heard of them but they're stocked at Mecca. For those of you that are Australian you'll know Mecca but if not it's just like a makeup store. It's like Sephora. And then I thought this was funny but Naomi actually also got me a little Frank body thing. It's a little charcoal face cleanser and how cute is this tiny little packet. I love it. Then I got some presents from my brother. This year we decided to do Secret Santa. I have three brothers so it was me me, them and then Liam as well. We all did like Secret Santa and we all bought each other a present. My youngest brother Matt got me so he gave me this little bouncy ball thing which I actually lost and I'm really devastated about it because I wanted to practice my handball, bring out my inner primary school persona because in primary school you guys I was so good at handball. At school we had one of those courts that's like nine and I used to be the best at handball. But then also he got me a Rebel Sport voucher which I appreciate because I'm either going to buy myself some weights, I really want like some dumbbell weights or I might just get myself a cute little hoodie or something like that. Who knows? The world is my oyster. And then he got me this piece of a 
bike. He's really into BMXing and he told me that this is like the start of my BMX that apparently I'm going to build myself. So, you know, watch out. Maybe I'll bring out some BMX building vlogs. And then last, but definitely not least, is the present that Liam gave me. And if you watched my Christmas vlog, you've probably already seen these. But he gave me these Nike blazers. I love them so much. I've been waiting to film this video before I wore them out. I love, 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 love Jordans. Recently, I've become obsessed, but they are so expensive. Um, but these blazers are kind of a similar style and a lot, lot cheaper. So that's what he got me. But that is everything. Thing I got this Christmas. Thank you so so much. If any of you are watching that got me a present, I love them all. Yeah, let me know below what you guys got for Christmas. I'd be so curious to know what you got, what your favorite present was. As always, I'll link my Instagram below if you guys want to follow me on there. Feel free. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day wherever you are, and hopefully, I will see you in my next video. Bye, you guys. <laughs>